Hey everybody, the Banga's back. Welcome to part 5 of Let's Play Dragon Ball Z The Legacy of Goku. Brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Yeah, I know, Go Goku, I'm very salty about dying at the end of the last episode as well. So I did a lot of level grinding and now I'm at level 17. My max HP is only 8,000, but my key is at 25,000. And we can stay flying for like a count of 40. Not bad. Could be a little bit better, but could also be worse. So, looks like we gotta like clear out these schmucks again. <sighs> I hate when the solar flare is just not ready when you want it to be ready. There, we did enough damage to the point where we can pretty much just plug them in the back and then they just die. Still gotta find two more trees for that dude though. Hopefully I can find some in the immediate vicinity. Oh, I could have easily just gone around this way. Um, guess we'll just keep going in that direction then. Okay, it takes like three or four hits with my fist to kill that guy. Oh, dinosaurs are back. Great. Oh, what? He got two hits in a row? Jeez. I didn't think that was going to happen. Oh, well, I'll just sock the pterodactyl this way. Once it gets over here, which it probably will, I'll be ready for it. Again, these pterodactyls give you, what, 2,000 experience? And I think last time we fought these dinos, they were, what, 4,000 each. Which is still good. I mean, I'm not gonna say oh, only 4,000 experience. That's pretty bad. I mean, it's only bad if we're needing, what, 500,000 experience to gain a level. And right now, it still looks like we only need, what, four of these guys killed, and then you gain a level? Just walked on mushrooms. What the hell, man? Just made the baby Mario cry. Now you're, like, melding into the wall. You deserve death for that. So we got ourselves our second tree. Yeah, I just punched this guy in the ass and now he's dead. Just deal with this dino first. Man, if, it, if I had like a cooldown timer, this would have made solar flares that much better. Most of the times I'm just mashing the B button. It's like, okay, you need to be ready now. Oh, there's the last tree. That guy is watching over it. There we go. Plugged him. This tree will grow big and strong, I hope. Don't know how much of a future it has here on Namek. <laughs> I guess if you watch the anime, you pretty much already have an idea. Um, oh, I can pretty much just kill anything except the pterodactyl, and then I'll get to the next level. Like, the more levels I have at this point of the game will be that much more beneficial. Don't hurt me! It's okay. I'm here to help. Th don't come closer! Don't hurt me, please! It's alright now. Only dreams. <laughs> Of course, the first enemy I run into is a pterodactyl. Something where I still need to kill one other thing to gain a level. Oh, apparently, these kinds of guys need a, like an extra hit or two. Even though they give out the same amount of experience. Weird, but oh well. No, there ain't. I got three trees there. You said you only needed, what, three? I gave you three! What the hell? Is the quest broken? There isn't four trees, is there? Why did that guy take much longer to die? Okay, yeah, I think the quest is broken. Because... 
can't just dispense the trees, can you? Oh, I can plant them myself. Okay, I kind of wish I knew that. I thought I was just supposed to bring the uh, saplings over to him. You can't put it in this hole. What about this one? 7,000 experience just for protecting the environment. Good job, Goku. That's how you get things done. Look at this guy. How did that not hit him? Oh, oh now he notices. That was pathetic. That wasn't, though. Uh, I might as well get myself to full HP. I still have these flowers from, like, much earlier in the game. So I'm gonna check out that temple now. Wow, it took more shots than I expected to get that guy killed. The attacks seem a little inconsistent for the amount of damage that I'm dealing. That's a little alarming. Like, I can't rely on my punches doing the same amount of damage. I mean, you don't see, like, a uh, health indicator. So sometimes you just ain't gonna know until it's too late. Come over here and die. Okay, peck me in the face, I don't care. It means nothing to me now. Oh, well, I missed. Again, the hit detection. That's why if you got some uh, Dragon Ball Z games for the Game Boy Advance, I hope to gather their legacy of Goku 2 and Boo's Fury. Because they are really awesome games. Oh my god. Just manages to sidestep me every single time and then still hit me anyway. Why is my hitbox practically the largest thing in the world? It alarms me so much. That guy didn't even do anything. Okay, that took me one hit to kill that pterodactyl. Again, inconsistent damage. At least I'm getting myself closer to another level up at this rate. Ugh, I got the urge to herbal again because... I'm not that good of avoiding damage. Okay, this must be where the temple is. Okay, I don't want to go in there yet. Wow, this is sure an old temple. Wow, that's rude. Show some respect. You'll probably have to go in there eventually. I mean, look at that. That's ridiculous. And he still hits me. I gotta save my lone Senzu bean for much later. Okay, there's a lot going on around here when it comes to enemies. Okay, that guy's toast. This would seem like a great spot to level grind given how many of them there are. How did I not hit this guy? This is so goddamn stupid. Look at that. He can hit me from anywhere I get hurt. I have to make sure that I'm standing in a very specific area. And even then, I might still miss. It's bullshit, I'm telling ya. I can't rely on actually hitting this guy. Look at that! Our hit-
hitboxes were practically overlapping. And even at level 18, I still get my shit caved in here. It took less hits to kill that guy before. And it took me, what, 9 or 10 now? Again, that's just sad. I'm gonna save, like, the amount of experience I got so I can level up faster. Oh, wow, that one hit did so much! He's still not dead! Did you see that? I'm tilting bad. I only need to get, like, one more of these guys dead, and I gain a level. There. I get the level up before I actually throw my punch. We hit each other at the same time. Good job. Um, okay, I probably had to kill like over 16 of these guys to gain another level. at the top of this hill. This must be one of the artifacts that the uh, Namekians managed, mentioned earlier. Yeah, I don't want to die here after getting this far. I can't believe I never hit this guy once. Oh, come on! This is so dumb! The hitboxes are just jank! You have to stand so specific! You shouldn't have to do that! Good. Finally, an extra herb for me to pick up. Oh, come on! He had just enough time to still hit me. Hello, Goku! King Kai! Your friends, Tien, Yamcha, Chiaotzu, and Piccolo are all up here with me! I'm training them hard, and teaching them jokes, too! If Gohan and Krillin can get the Dragon Balls from Frieza and his henchmen, we'll be able to wish Piccolo back to life, which will bring the Earth Dragon Balls back! Great! I haven't seen them yet, but I hope everything is okay! Eh, they're fine. Um, we'll just save again. <coughs> Had a tickle in my throat there. Um, I guess we'll just hope for the best. Get this guy chasing me. I half expected that Key Blast to still hit me. That's how unreliable this game is. Okay, I don't think I'm gonna sock him from here. What was the point of going to this area then? Just get some dialogue? Should be able to get up here some way. Maybe I was supposed to start from the right side? But it looks like I don't need to go to that temple right now. Oh, this music is so tacky here. Alright, let's try approaching from this side. There's probably more of these, uh... Yeah, I can go back and get another herb. Which I'm actually going to pretty much use right away. Because god, no matter how many times you level, it feels like you're two hits from dying. Yeah, I know. We've already seen it. We haven't gotten inside of it, but we will. Looks like this is not the way to go. I think I can still get these artifacts from outside the temple. Like, maybe I don't even have to go in the temple yet. Oh, I could've just flew up here the whole time! Oh, wow. I just wasted my life. <laughs> Going around all 
this. Got one of the artifacts. Awesome. I think that's the other one right there. Unless it's just a tree. Well, I guess trees can be an artifact in their own right. Especially with how old they can be. Nope, that actually was a tree. Never mind. Bean. That's actually very good to get one right here. Why can't I fly down? That is weird. You can only fly down a certain way. That is weird as hell. Um, now that we got like a second Senzu Bean, we should be a little bit more set for healing. Which I most likely still have to do frequently. I'm just gonna go down the long way to save on flight power. Because God knows I might need it real soon. Is there anything to pick up around here? Around this corner? No. Okay. Guess I'll just go straight in now. waiting for me inside this temple. Oh. Max flight power. Oh wow, that's a big ass statue there. Look at the size of that belly button too. Give freely to your brothers and honor will be yours. I just walked on like some big block and all of a sudden I just got warped. Hitbox on this guy is really warped. Warped in a bad way. Um, okay. Give freely to your brother. Um, what does the color have to do with it then? Do I have to like look for more artifacts? I know I got a blue one. And a red one. Banish will be he who keeps from his village. Oh, this guy got like two belly buttons now. There's a hand. Oh, secret passage. Oh, there's a green artifact. I have all the artifacts. Now all I need to do is find where to place them. I would imagine it'd be pretty obvious where they need to go based on their respective color. Hopefully that's all I need to do. Okay, these are just warps. Oh, come on! That was a bullshit place for an enemy! Oh, wow. Absolute garbage on that play. Well, at least I'll gain another level when I get one of these guys killed. Okay, I'm at level 20 now. Oh my god, look at all the health I just got. So the orange one is not going to help me. Oh god, all the scumbags respawn. Okay, the green 
Missing one did not help me. Try the blue one. Blue one sends you back where you start. Let me read that again. Give freely to your brothers and honor will be yours. The red one, maybe? Oh, wow, that guy died in one hit. This feels like it took me somewhere. Oh, I see another Senzu bean. I'd like to get that first. Let me explore this entire pathway. Except I can only explore so much, so I guess we are going on this one. And I'm back where I started again. What the hell? Try the green one again? Nope, that's back where I started again. I still don't like that they warp you over here. So this guy be ready for you immediately. God, I have no idea where we need to go. And I don't think the artifacts really reveal anything for you. Okay, so don't go on the yellow one because it does no benefit for you. Well, there's a... Okay, there's... This one had three belly buttons. I wonder if that has anything to do with it. Once you accept your fate, you will know no bounds. Step on the white one again? Nope. This is back where we started again. Do I just fly to the statue? No, you don't. Alright. I don't see where you place those uh, artifacts. But I gotta keep looking. Like, I saw three statues. So they gotta have some purpose. Once you accept your fate, you will know no bounds. Well, this doesn't help me here. Maybe I didn't go this way yet. Oh, this is a different area. Remember that a scorned youth could be a future enemy. Lots of statues here. This one has four belly buttons. Do I just like follow the hands? Why does there have to be like so many warps? Uh, oh god damn it. This is memorization here! This is dumb! Well, I'm at level 21, so that feels anything but dumb. But still! Who thought this puzzle was a good idea? There's no clues to anything! I have, like, all three artifacts that I need. Did I ever go through this entire pathway? Another arrow. Okay, I think I was here before. At least these guys are dropping like flies. So there's a silver lining in all this. Oh, man, we're, I'm so lost. <laughs> um, so I'll have to like think this through. 
Why don't you give me, like, what, several minutes, and I'll figure this one out, okay? Okay, I'm back. This is actually the first room, and I think I figured out a solution. It involves, like, going through a wall. Yeah, there's actually another route you can take. You just have to go through this wall over here. So after a bit of digging around, I managed to find it. And I think I've been in this room a few times, seeing the two teleporters right next to each other. Well, I might as well kill this guy because I'm pretty much at the level where I can mass kill these guys with relative ease. Remember that it's going in, blah, 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 yeah, whatever. So I think I have to go all the way here, or is it left? Yeah, I think it's this one. Maybe it's not this one. Oh, wow, that one actually takes you back to the same spot. Okay, so I kind of messed that up. Level 22! Awesome. Okay, I think I remember now. I was actually supposed to go on... This teleporter? All the way to the southeast? My phone is lighting up now. No time to check that for the time being. And I think I have to keep going to this one. Yep, this looks like the place right here. Oh yeah, this is the spot. And I'll just place the artifacts right over here. Yeah, these definitely look like slots for them. Your speed increases again. 30,000 experience points. What was that sound? I think I heard it coming from over there to the left. Are you sure? Because I can't really pinpoint it unless it's this one. Let's just keep going this way. Oh, this was the right spot. Hey guys. Hey Krillin. Looks like you guys have your hands full here. Wow, I'm so glad you made it, Goku. We were really worried. This monster, Frieza, he's trying to get the Dragon Balls of Namek, and he's destroying everything in his path. His elite fighting force, the Ginyu Squad, is here. Come and get it, Shorty. Oh great, I gotta deal with the with Ginyu Force. Are you okay, Gohan? Hey Dad. Bulma told us you were on your way to Namek, but I don't think we can beat these guys. These are some of Frieza's best warriors. We have to stop them somehow. So you decide to show up, hey Kakarot? Vegeta, what are you doing here? I'm here to get the Dragon Balls, you idiot. Your little friends and I have formed a team. You see, we have a common cause. None of us want Frieza to have the Dragon Balls. Yeah, that much is true. That must be them right here. Um, let's actually give them a good fight. Oh. Hi. A Saiyan without a tail, huh? Very interesting. I will enjoy watching the Ginyu Squad defeat you. Perhaps they have a special pose they would like to perform after wiping you out. Besides, I'd rather not break a sweat. Oh, we actually don't fight? <laughs> Come on, we're brand new pose. Whatever. Somehow that guy's not dead. Again, very misleading with the damage. I killed that dino in one hit! Holy crap. I got like 70 flying power. There's herbs all over the place. What is up with all this Mountain Dew? Better grab as many herbs as I can. Just in case we gotta fight Ginyu Force real soon. Um, I think I'm gonna save and stop here. So, oh, I forgot to save actually. That would be a good idea. So, in the next part, we'll deal with uh, Ginyu Force and possibly Frieza. See everybody.